Oh my gosh. This is going to blow your mind. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, please hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my videos. I am actually showing you a DIY that I was inspired to do. Okay, so we have the McCart cuticle oil that came in the um, Sweet Cravings kit. I'm using the strawberry. And this is going to be a simple DIY that you can do as a peel-off base coat. Now you're probably thinking, Jamie, really? Really? Yes, guys, really. So what you're going to do is you're just going to get the, a cuticle oil, whichever cuticle oil you want to use. You're going to go ahead and apply that on the nail. You don't have, it doesn't matter how much you put on there. Just put it on there. And as you can see, I put quite a bit on all my nails. You're just going to lather it on those nails. If it gets in the cuticle, well, you know what? No problem. It's cuticle oil. <laughs> if anything, it's really good for your nails. So then I take my McCart Awesome Color Base Coat, and I'm just going to go right over the top of that cuticle oil. And then I do um, wipe my brush off in between. That way the cuticle oil will not get into the base coat bottle. So just remember to do that. You want cuticle oil in with your base coat. The girl I was inspired by, I'm going to put her channel up on the screen. She did this about eight months ago. And her name is Amber Mitchell. And I will put her channel link down below. So thank you, Amber. All right, so after you put on the last nail, go ahead and do a 30-second cure, just like you normally would. Now, this is what they look like. You can still see the cuticle oil around the nails, so I do kind of clean that up before I go in and apply the tips. Now, the nails that I do in this video, you guys are not going to see me do them all. I just show you that I am applying them over the cuticle oil and the base coat, but that video is already up. So definitely go and check it out. That was the Who Has the Clearest Poly Gel video. So I just put, as you see me here, I am putting the nail right over that cuticle and base gel. Put it right over the top of it, guys. No joke, this stuff worked amazing. Now, when I usually do my nails like this, I, I use the Unt Peel-Off Base Coat. And right away, after I'm done filming, the nails literally just pop off and actually they will they have popped off while I was actually doing my nails so <laughs> the it doesn't last very long unless you're doing like gel polish only or something like that okay so you just saw me I put some more cuticle oil on the nails rub that in really really good and you can actually turn your nail over and put some cuticle oil down in where your free edge is up under the nail tip I would definitely suggest you do that. That way the cuticle oil can soak down in there and make for a lot easier removal. Because I honestly, at, when I was trying to get these off, I thought, oh my gosh, these are not coming off. Because they just didn't want to come off. And then I think after that cuticle oil sat there for a little longer and soaked in to the nail, it made it easier for them to actually come off. But I promise you guys, they will come off. And it's not going to ruin the nail. It's not, it's not, you're not like prying it off like you would, you know, how, you know how some people do. They will pry their actual acrylics off or their gels off. Well, this is not like that. I promise. Your nail is not going to get ruined. And as you saw there, I took that tool and I just went up under by the cuticle area and I, um, I just pulled it up a little bit and then it just popped right off. But I was very, very impressed by this method. Don't know who came up with it originally, um, but shout out to them because it's a brilliant idea. You guys will have to let me know what you think and let me know if you try it. Actually, let me know how long the nails last. I might try that, guys. If you want me to try that, let me know. I'll do it on my other hand and we'll see how long the nails will last doing it this way. Because I promise you, I could have I worn these at least a few days. Maybe even a week. It's right off. And like I said, if you put the cuticle oil um, underneath the nail by your 
free edge. I think it'll come off a lot easier. And maybe soak it in some warm water if you have to. But honestly, I don't think there's, there's really no need for all that. They really did come off nice. I didn't have much of an issue at all. I was just really shocked that it even worked. Because when I saw her video, I was like, oh my gosh, no way. This isn't going to work. But yeah, it did. And I'm, I'm happy. And that's what my nails look like. Nothing's damaged. None of the skin peeled off. It looks great, guys. So I, ha I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new. I hope you all have a blessed day, and I'll see you soon. God bless. Bye.